I graded four video games with CGC video games. Let's take a look at those bad boys, shall we? So this is a little bit different kind of video. Uh, I'm not going to be doing a full-blown return. Just going to show you guys kind of what I got. I got four games. I graded them. Uh, pretty much just nostalgia games for me growing up as a kid. Uh, dedicated tons of hours to primarily three of these games. The other one kind of just fits my collection. But I'm excited to show you what these look like. These things are freaking dope. Check these out. Look at these. NHL hits 2002 9.4A. My favorite, probably my favorite game on PlayStation 2, right next to GTA. But Custom Robo, GameCube, absolute banger, 9.6A+. Killzone got me into first-person shooters, 9.6A+. If you never played Killzone, Custom Robo, NHL hits, I'm sorry your childhood was trash. But these games are peak nostalgia. Of course, couldn't I have to t finish off my Halo collection? These are uh, those were the uh, do not sell before copies, but this I couldn't I couldn't uh, couldn't swing the first print of this game because that's expensive. So I went with a 9.0 A, uh, bought it Game of the Year edition, beautiful game. But man, let me tell you, these freaking cases are nice, like sleek. Just, I don't know, guys. I think uh, I think we got some stiff competition. Like I've every game I own, obviously is not obviously. I don't have any VGAs, but has gone through WADA. I graded all of them except one of them. I per uh, purchased I purchased a couple, but yeah. So this is my WADA case. Um, as you can see, it's a little bit, a little more clunky. Put a little side by side action. It's a little bit taller. This is a DVD style, so the game's a little bit taller. Not a fair comparison. One second. That just fell. That's lovely. How did that fall? Literally just set it on this flat surface. So, two DVD style games. Watt is a little bit taller. Um, this one's definitely a little bit thinner, but the bases, this one, obviously just, it's way more clunky. The top of it, this thing is like a clip. Um, th I don't know. This thing looks freaking clean. I'm in, I'm in love. I'm in love with, uh, what I have going on right now with that, that graded game from CGC. But yeah, this, uh, I'm not a fan. I saw a bunch of uh, new boxes Wada's going to be doing. I don't know if they've released. Let me know down in the comments if you do. I, I don't think I've seen any of these new Wada cases come out yet. Um, but I'm a huge fan of the way these feel. Huge fan. Like, I thought I wasn't going to be a big fan of this situation, the thin up top. But let me tell you, the thing feels sleek. And I'm loving it, like McDonald's. It literally feels like the same size of like uh, one of those VHS cases for like uh, Lion King or something like that. You know what I mean? But absolute stunner. This thing, like I said, it's it definitely weighs more. It weighs far more. I'd say this is two thirds the weight of this one. I'm not gonna go get a scale right now. This thing is way heavier. Um, good could be, however you want to look at it, good or bad. Um, but yeah, this, uh, I don't know. I don't know, guys. Let me know what you think. Which one do you like more case wise? Not looking at the games, but if I could right now send in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, my 11 ish WADA games to just directly transfer them to those with the same grade, I'd be on it. I would do that. And not to mention, gotta mention it, tonight, today, 
the WADA signature, not WADA, Heritage signature auction just happened. There was two of the same games. There was one in a CGC case, one in a WADA case of Super Mario Bros. 3, both graded 9.8 A++. The CGC one sold for $60,000, which matched basically the highest peak sale of that game variant in the same grade. The WADA one sold for $38,000, so there was a huge difference there. Uh, huge enough to be like, uh, was it shilled? Who knows, but... I guess we'll see if it's paid for. Uh, but yeah, $22,000. It outsold it in the CDC slab. They seem to be selling damn well. I've never in my life, coming from the trading card game world, in my life, when CDC trading cards came onto the field, no contest. They were not competing with PSA Day 1. They still aren't competing with PSA Day 1 in similar grades. It's insane what CGC Video Games is already capable of doing. Big respect to them. Great rollout. This is freaking awesome. You guys are doing great. I cannot wait to send more games to you guys because... Sheesh. It just... Something about it. Something about it. She's darn pretty, y'all. Darn pretty. Anyways, let me know down below which one you would pick. They're both freaking dope, but I don't know if CGC gets a nod in this one. Talk to you guys soon. Peace. <laughs>